This is the outskirts of Beijing, and I'm at the gate of one of the only nuclear reactors of its type in the world. It's taken months of negotiation, but hopefully I'm about to be allowed in. Yeah. Kept under wraps inside this innocuous box at Tsinghua University is a Chinese prototype reactor that researchers claim is uniquely safe. This reactor currently is the only paper bed tested reactor in the world. When Professor Wu Zhongxin started nuclear research in the early 60s, water-cooled reactors were all the rage. So were the hats. The pebble bed reactor he runs now is oh, radically is different. Uh, this is the safe <laughs> yes, part. Yeah. Oh, okay. This vessel is for steam generator. This vessel for reactor. Because instead of fuel rods, his reactor is filled with 27,000 of these, the nuclear pebble. No problem. <laughs> Luckily, they're built strong enough here to be dropped 50 times before they break. Each pebble is a perfect graphite sphere filled with specially coated particles of enriched uranium. So these are the radioactive particles, the, the heart of the fuel. Uh, yeah, heart fuel here. And outside, we coat it to four layers. 8,000 particles inside a hollow sphere means that each pebble works like a mini reactor. The pebbles are recycled around and through the core. Uh, this efficient energy produced okay. is the core. Its high running temperatures are more efficient for generating electricity. Because these reactors use helium gas for cooling, instead of complicated plumbing, they should also be safer to operate. Yeah. That is very different from other reactors where it's water under pressure. Yeah, 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 yeah. So this is this the feature of the reactor. Yes. It's the helium for the cooler, coolant. That's the difference. Because we it, it all leads to a daring safety test that would be unthinkable in any other power plant. For this reactor, I think basically we can prove it is a metal-free reactor. The professor invites scientists from around the world to watch what happens when you deliberately set up an accident by switching off the cooling system. That sounds like a dangerous thing to do in a nuclear reactor, to get it running, get it critical, and then turn off the cooling system. Yeah, 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 sure. It's the very, very dangerous, it's the, it's of course. What they do here is exactly what causes catastrophic meltdowns at water-cooled reactors, as happened at Chernobyl and Three Mile Island. But is it dangerous here? I know, no, okay. because we always we have to some the pass we remove all the decay heat. So the reactor is able to get rid of more heat than it can actually hold in itself. The nuclear physics inside this reactor means that the higher the temperature, the slower the chain reaction. Unlike a water-cooled reactor, the pebble bed doesn't go into meltdown. The reactor goes to sleep and the test is a success.